Yeah, we're here at Mount St. Anne um, up in Canada. It's one of my favorite World Cups. It's, it's about five hours away from my house, so it's kind of the like a home race for me. My family, friends are here, so. Yeah, I um, am the new U.S. national champion, so I'm so excited. That was a big goal of the season. Uh, I'm feeling great, you know, everything is working and, and the legs are feeling good, so yeah, it should be a battle out there. I feel better and uh, I look forward for Saturday race and uh, it's much faster and uh, it will be much better for me because a lot of power to the technical section, I like it bike is perfect, uh, it's a big difference uh, than the last one. Uh, it's much aggressive, much shorter, faster to the corners and uh, yeah, I love it. Um, the boys are all on the new Epic, uh, they're very stoked about the new bike, so uh, we also got some new wheels for 2014 that are going on to this bike. So the wheel itself is a little bit wider and also normal wheels always have the beat hug. Uh, we got rid of that because we find out that we don't need that to keep the tire in place. Uh, so you put strength into the rim, makes it stiffer and also more resistance for pinch flats or anything like that. With doing that, uh, we got a lighter wheel, stiffer wheel, more resistant wheel without adding any weight. Um, yeah, I like the course a lot. It's um, still yeah, very demanding. It has the climbs and it's very different actually. The first part is more like the physical part and the last part is like with a lot of cornering and single track. So actually it's quite fun to ride and um, I think it's going to be a good race. I think we've got about seven minutes here till the start of the race and then it'll be all out. The climb is the most important part for this first lap to get in good position for the single track. Yeah, the start for me was a little slow, but really not too bad because there's a pretty big hill to make up some time here. But unfortunately, with three laps to go, I was pushing my bike up a slippery rock section and my shoulder came out once. It kind of fell back into place and I kept on riding and it didn't feel too bad. And then the next lap, it came out even worse and just not ideal for racing. forth back and forth and I would attack then the next person would come back and but the last two laps it was just all in and luckily it worked out I just tried to like keep it smooth and not make any mistakes because this this course is about not making mistakes. Leah and I were together at the front of the race from the beginning so it was just like a dream start and I think we were like with the lead till third lap or something we were always uh, within sight of each other like and then on this high speed corner my front wheel slipped in a loose uh, gravel and then I lost a little momentum but uh, ended up in the top 10 so that was really good um good sign for the rest of the season where there still are some important races left so that's that's awesome It was a little bit better than, uh, than Andorra because uh, the first lap today was in incredible. I was first and uh, I will focus uh, everything for Peter Meisburg and the uh, last World Cup. It's, uh, it's main goal because uh, this season uh, was not so good. We will see. No good to start. Maybe start in place. Just a problem, my condition. <laughs> yeah, need training. Yeah. 